Right, good morning everyone. I have got another parcel that's just arrived. Um, well, two bags of beads, bro well, jewellery. But what I want to ask is, um, I'm doing the out of stock items and I've come across these two that are saying they're out of stock. There's a couple of other bits and pieces that I vaguely remember somebody ordering. If you ordered these, remember that bracelet if you ordered that you need to contact me and then i'll look up your order if you can tell me when you ordered it because i think i've missed an order somewhere somehow and i am really sorry if i have um you know i am doing this on my own and it's uh can be hectic at times but i just don't recall i recall seeing an order but i don't recall doing the order with these and they've shown up on the out of stock so obviously somebody's bought them there's that one and that they could be two different orders i don't think so i think it's from the same order i'm not generally that stupid you know so i do think they're from the same order and if it's you please let me know if you ordered them i can check up on your um uh orders once i know a name i can put a name to the order and then I can make sure that I have completely finished all your orders. Because don't forget, sometimes, like some of you ladies, I mean, it's fantastic that you order like you do. But you um, sometimes you order like two or three times in one week. And it can happen that I misplace an order. And it's very, very rare that I do. But hey, um, just let me know if it's you. So that's that i'll keep them to one side so that i know i can sort that out now uh let's have a look this lot came in and i'm to a totally different seller so i'm just going to have a quick look through it and see what we have so that is that let me go get my box And I can put all the bits that I find. What's this? Oh, that's nice, isn't it? Like a necktie. Uh, just a silver plate, 18 inch chain. Nice though. Very nice. So I'm just going to put them straight in the box love these metal beads the spacers look at that great for stick pins really nice and we've got that one looks like those uh, army guys isn't it marines <laughs> bracelet bunch of bracelets again they are new they've still got their uh, nice color like a sea green sea blue sea green what are these <laughs> little frogs but can be used as a miniature you can paint them and uh, put them on the grass if you're doing a miniature garden or something so there's those these are acrylic but like i say you can uh, use them as um decoupage pictures on and then put lace around the back and use them as a on your project somewhere a lot of people, you know, do ask, what can I do with this fee? They're quite nice. Yeah. Little star earrings. What are these? Ah, obviously it's because there's a uh, backing. But whew, what could you do with that? You could make that into a miniature crown. Put some bling on it. Put some wire. Wire wrap it and whatnot make a crown out of it for a miniature doll it's quite pretty let's just have a look see what we've got oh nice red crystals gorgeous let's have a look i don't want to tangle anything i can help it oh that's pretty so it's a necklace Hmm, very nice. Let's have a look. Oh, we've had this one before. A couple of times, actually. 
This is why I know they're coming in from, uh, you know, the likes of charity shops and that, you know, where they often sell the bling, but there's many a time they have to change it because they can't sell it. They're ask they ask too much for it, that's the problem. Ah, now, <laughs> I'm going to use that because I do need that bling for that plaque I'm doing, which that will be loaded up uh, shortly, folks. I've just been so busy. I don't generally keep stuff like that. It's I, I can't be bothered with it. It's not worth my... And it's too heavy. So that will go straight away in the bin, unfortunately. What's this one? Oh, these are like just beads underneath. Like a clear plastic bead, I would imagine, or a pearl bead. Not sure if we can get a sneak preview of what's underneath. Probably not. Otherwise, I wouldn't sell it. So I'm just going to cut it and see if the beads are any good. Oh, white bead. So I will dismantle that and we'll get rid of the, um, sell the white beads. When I say get rid of, I mean sell them. Um, and if somebody wanted that, I'm sorry, but I'll only sell certain things. Um, acrylic beads. Oh, look, like my spyglass. <laughs> It just wants pol. Let me just see if I can polish that up. It's usually because it's got hairspray on it or something. Oh, blood me neck. I wouldn't have bought mine if I'd have known I could find one in one of these lot. <coughs> yeah, it's gone clean. See, mine's a circle one. And I do use mine. That's great. Because they're handy if you can't see, like me. Oh god, we've had that one before. Nice beads though. Tiny beads and they're real pearls. Right, let's have a look. Bangles, like I say, just for the beads. Nice little pearl, that's a glass pearl bracelet. But nice size beads, six millimeter. Look great on stick pins. Mother of Pearl. Right, let's have a look. Let's just see if we can sort this. Another bracelet. Just, these are like a rice bead, but they're acrylic and they're fused. But they look good if you're using them on a project and you can paint them. So I always include those in your parcels because you never know what you might want them for. There's a... Nice purple beads and can be dismantled. Those can be used for frames. Take the bead out. You do have to think outside the box. Brass beads. Nice chain. Fancy chain if you want to put it on something. We don't usually do anything with those. Right, let me just look. Twisted bangle, which you can use as a frame. If you're doing a round picture, you can put pearls or diamante on the inside or the outside. Put it, Do it on your non-stick mat, and that way you can make your own frame. I've shown you how to do them. And they look really nice. And then you can paint them all up, do whatever you like with them. Oh, that's a nice bracelet. Got elephants on it. Now, all of those can come apart and you can make them into charms. That's nice. That'll be sold individually. There's not many I get out to sell individually, so when I can, I do. Because I have to, you know, put back what I've laid out in the first place for the bags. Little diamante hat. A bracelet, glass beaded one, and you've got the um, little rosette ones, the glass beaded one. Right, I hope you've been seeing this because my battery just ran out again. No, don't like things like that, Fee. 
neither of those and it's got a name on it anyway that one you can um use and it's got the tree of life on it as a charm they're quite heavy but it's got um metal bead as well as pearl bead and then you've all the little spaces in between Another beaded one. Oh, I thought that was a button. It's like the shape of a button, but it's a necklace. A few bracelets in this one. Nice pot beads, and then you've got lots of little charms. And there's that one. not to tangle anything up again you've got uh, nice crystal beads nice Murano beads nice spacers fancy beads this one quite a few bracelets in this one actually but they just get sold off for the beads at the end of the day if you want to wear them that's up to you I don't generally keep those either although these can be used as frames and make your own you know you build out you can go around with diamante round with pearl put your pictures in whatever you want to do with them or just do it on that side so they will be included in kits ban the bomb do you remember when that first started ban the bomb bloody hell and it's still going ban the bomb Oh, that's quite heavy bracelet it can still be worn though again use those as uh, pictures you know put pictures on deck of your pictures on it's you have to come up with the ideas I'm helping you by giving you some ideas oh those are those magnetic beads but they've got lots of cat's eye beads and spaces on so it's only the magnetic beads you can get rid of if you don't want or use them in a bracelet it doesn't matter get plenty of these in don't we with the chain but these i like these because you can cut the elastic and you end up with a long chain that you probably make six seven eight charms you know bad charms out of so it's great saving really have a look Oh, it's acrylic it's not gemstone it just looks like um but great for making miniatures from paddles and um fencing you know making fencing paint them up make them look like wood a lot of things you can do and save nobody will ever know what you've done another one of those Let's have a look at this a chain another one of those oh these are the rings which come in handy many time you know cut that and you've got a, a wad full of them put them in a jar you don't save things like that feet when it's in that condition now this is one of those uh, dangle bracelets but what i like about it is the stones got like these crystals in look see that's quite nice that I just take it apart one of the um love love with a metal bead on bling bead this one again really pretty right, have a look at this one little dangle beads but it's uh, you know that can be used somewhere else there we go another one can be used somewhere 
or dismantle it. You know, it's completely up to you what you do. Nice one there. Again, that can be the, the top of uh, a set of other, uh, if you've got the deep ones, because we do sell the deep ones as well. Like I say, if that's a bracelet, a deep one, you put that on the top, so that you can make that into a rim. Um, and there's a tassel on it as well, which can probably come in handy somewhere. No, we don't sell those. Nice little dragonfly. These are acrylic, both sets of beads are acrylic, but they're beautiful colours. And dismantle them and make a bracelet with it, or a charm. Oh, that's pretty. Why is it like, oh, there it is. You know, that's really pretty. My daughter's going to the races on Saturday. She's staying longer than normal. Normally she'd be home by Wednesday and back in London. But she's uh, going to the races with about seven or eight of her friends. And last night I made her a fascinator to wear. And I'm going to show you a picture of it and I'll join it to this. And then um, let me know what you think. I literally made the uh, fascinator flower section by hand. And you, some of you may remember I once did something similar. And let me know what you think. But she bought a plain hat and I had to decorate it. And I, I love doing things like that for her because I'm making memories with her. Nice little charmy beaded bracelet. They see you can take those off individually and hang them somewhere else. What is this one? Uh -oh. Now those can be used as connectors. Oops, got it stuck on my uh, thing. Little heart with a diamante. Nice bracelet. They're all wearable. That's, uh, you know, I do try and get everything that's wearable. Nice chain. Little diamante. I think that's one of those, um, yeah, hang on, let's have a look, two different ones there. Like I say, these can be used as um, decoupage your picture on. They're really nice and we don't waste, well, we try not to waste anything at all. And that's just a bar. But that to me would become a curtain rod <laughs> with a miniature, it's a curtain rod, oh God. I know, I know, but see, I can't help myself, I, to, I can repurpose almost anything, oh that's pretty, but I just dismantle the stones and use them somewhere, I'm going to keep that one for the stones actually, that's pretty, now we've got this one with the agate, um, with the oh, I can't remember the name of it, but hey ho, and the rice beads, right? Let's have a look at this. So this is one of those. I think you know what you can um, pull up. Yeah, one of those that you can pull up or down, and it's got the leaves on it. Um, this one, that's really pretty. I like those. Navy blue, <laughs> look out for it. And then that one is basically just like charmy things that you can use, metal. And lots of spaces on there. So that's that bag and I'm just going to do the other one while I've got the chance. Hopefully my camera won't run out before I do. Let's just see if there's anything in here. See, nice size 
keychain. Oh, look at that. Pretty. I'm going to take the things out that I don't want. Too big, too heavy. <gasps> oh, look. Look, 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 look. Come on, don't do this to me, mate. Nice. Very nice. Bling! Not too sure which way I'm going to go with this because I might be messing it up myself. I think there's earrings and uh, charmy bracelets there. Acrylic. But you see these in the middle. Now this is, I had one like this and I used, if you think back to when I did the boudoir, when I made the miniature boudoir and I had the little pearls that were like bones and I used them for the dogs. When I put the dogs in, put some on the dog's bed and on the side of the box where it slept because they look like miniature bones so i'm gonna keep that one again <laughs> well i use them i do a lot of miniatures just some hollow um tubing that you can use as connectors and some beads like a little pewter one i don't want to uh start at the wrong end I'll do as much as I can on this one. Look. All the charmy bits and some charms there. Oh, look, flower. That's pretty. And another one, a dangle one. So, let's have a look, see what else we've got. Statement necklace. Now, that's nice. And they've put, like, gold leaf in. Uh, large leaf with a small leaf, triple leaf. Now these, we've had this one the other week, do you remember? And I said you can uh, use them as swords. You know, you use that as a sword, put a knife hand on, handle on it. Um, and use it if you're doing a miniature. Lots of things to do with stuff like that. Just some... Uh, Bracelets, stack of new ones, thin ones. Let me just see, I don't want this to run out. Flexible, just like a choker. Let's have a look. There's some nice crystals. Ooh, look at this one. Lots of metal beads, and then you've got that. Gorgeous. Chunky one. Just think outside the box. Got those that can be used as frames. Probably not use that at all. No. Nice, different, uh, chunky beaded one. Ah, do you remember the other week when I saw one we had all the crystals in? I opened mine and took all the crystals out. And um, you can put them in and use them as shakers. Again, that's like a choker. Now, what on earth is this? A huge, huge necklace. Brand new. Still got its label on. And it's just... Let's have a look, see what they were charging. Well, they've got it on a, here as £3, so that's what the charity shop was charging. It was mainly took up with the, that necklace. But, you know, the beads are beads. These are the uh, Manelli Florence. That's a Manelli bracelet. 
says it on there. Nice for somebody. What's this one? Is this one? No, but it's very similar. Red fused. Although, no, 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 these can be taken apart. Red glass beads. Beautiful bracelet can be taken apart. Acrylic beads. Another one of those. Rose quartz. No, another one of those. The magnetic beads. What's this one? Oh, another one of those double things like that. It's got a tassel on it with a bow. See, like that. What's this one? That's a, a little charmy bracelet. There's some more of those beads, like clay beads. Uh, let's have a look across and just some bits and pieces that's left some agates and stuff like that yeah nice tassel on that one Another one of those, Murano uh, bracelet, and a little crystal one there with a glass heart. But like I say, lots here to play around with, and we shall bag it all up and have it on sale shortly. I might have to do it tomorrow though, folks, because I've been working since five o'clock this morning. I am tired, tired right now. I need to stop and I'm not moving about and my feet have started to swell so I do need to move about ah, that's a nice one so that's it and uh, like I say we have tons of jewellery for sale at the moment there's loads go online go to the shop oh, on the top of the bar click shop Type in what you're looking for, whether you're looking for lace, trims, braids. You have to type different words in for what you're looking at. There's over a thousand items on the shop at the moment, so it'll take you time to go through it. If you're looking for jewellery sets or jewellery packs, um, you might need to type grab bag or job lot or jewellery. And, you know, everything that we've got will come up. Just use different words for what you're looking for because sometimes I'll name like a lace, a, a ruffle. So I might call it um, a gathered or a ruffle. So you have to type both names in. Try one, then try the other. Or, or flat lace because we sell flat lace as well. So like I say, it's just do try and um, do a really good search with tons of everything. And... I want you lot to um, own it. So now I've got that, because remember I put this bracelet away from the other day for the uh, piece that I'm doing. But I actually need that instead. Not that. That's more vintage, so that's going to go in the... In the um, draw to break apart or to keep as is and somebody wear it but yeah I do collect my little bits out of all the bags this week I've only got that <laughs> it's not fair you know <laughs> I do have a lot though I've collected this for years right that's it for now thanks for watching take care and I will Speak to you all soon and if you want this you'll have to go to the shop and buy it. Bye bye for now.